Where are we going? Go, that way. go ahead. Okay. No, this way. So you can get on this side. So we can go that way. Yeah, yeah crosswalkers, watch out. Over there, over here. Take a picture. It was out this side. Okay. So I'll get I'll get a shot of the bike and then we'll get a shot of the train and I'll be sitting down like right here Okay, cool. like you'll get the back of my head Yes, sir. Careful, Hans Gisselke. I got nothing on me, sir. Help. You have the whole Same with that guy. Let me switch spots with him. Okay, I'll go right on this sit down. Okay, sir. I got you. Let me trade places with you right here. Yeah. Go ahead. Too bad. It is extremely fun. Hey, no way. You be on TikTok, right? Yeah. Hey, man, that's him. Oh, that's cool. That's the, hey, man. Is that a galaxy? And for those, I'm gonna make it back to my own universe. You tired, man? Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Always take care of this one, man. I know you're doing your time. Yeah, it's a, it's a lot of love, man. Of course. That's not much, but I'm, I'm glad we can help a yeah. little bit. Because y'all care, though. It's already here, then. So I immediately, uh... I'm fine. Yeah. Oh, we are. I want to get back to the Chicago sign real quick to get a video of... Oh, this is a one-way one way right here. Could have gone through there. <laughs> no, we can make it around. <laughs> Yeah, we'll just make a right right here. Watch out with this dude. I'm doing one more thing. Oh, okay, cool, yeah. All right, I think I got it. Eliza's texting. I'm gonna take a nap. <laughs> That's what she said. All right, I'm ready. Let's make a right to Dearborn and get on the bike lane. I'm a, uh, right here, we're gonna hang a left. I pull it away. All right, we're good. Oh, About to make a delivery. <laughs> Test it out. How see, do I see? See how it goes. Hold on, let me go online real quick. Unable to go online, take a photo of yourself. Continue. Stand by while we check it, it says. Okay, do you wanna make the left? I mean, make the right though? Yeah, let's just go. Let's just go home. Okay, whenever you're ready. All right, it says I'm online. No, wait a minute, we came down Harrison? Yeah. I never come down Harrison, ever. That's a sin. We can go, we can go through the bridge as pedestrians. No, it looks closed up here too. I know there's an entrance. It's a tough entrance though. Where'd she go? Where'd my wife go? What the heck? Bruh, what are you doing? Now we're going that way. You, you brought me on Harrison. And I said, I knew. Right here. You were like, I'm going to go see if we can go that way. And I was like, okay. Because I told you to turn right here at that light. All right, let's go then. All right, let's go. 
<laughs> All right, you guys. So I'm online. I don't know if I'll get anything. We're on my. I'm on my way home. It looks like I'm going away from the busy area, so it's unlikely that I'll get a delivery. We're good. We're nearing a busy area. It's the only busy area there is until we get home. So it's, it's if we don't get nothing, we got nothing. Archer? Yeah. I got one for 308. I'm, I'm going for it. 17 minutes, 1.2 miles. Let's accept that. I have no idea. Let's stop right here. Turn left on South Wentworth Avenue, then turn right. Okay, so it wants me to turn south on Wentworth Avenue. Let me navigate there real quick. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna go in there real quick. Let's see what they're talking about. Oh, let me turn this off because it'd be bothering people. Yeah, right, when you get into people's faces. Is it off? Yeah, it's off. Eric, Eric C. Hello, sir. I got a pickup for Eric C. What's that? Confirm, yes. Confirm, yes. All right, just confirmed it. All right, it's in there nice and tight. Let's go. All right. It's like you're not going to be here every time. But I'll take advantage of it. <laughs> we got to go back that way. On your left. Thank you. Is this it? 2121. I might not be at the right place. I'm on 21st, right? There's no bike wrecks here. So if my wife wasn't here, I'd have probably used this guy right here to lock the bike. And we didn't even bring any bike locks, actually. All right, come on. Okay, let me see what this instructions say. Call unit 12 on call box once arrived. It says meet at the door, so I probably got to go upstairs. Call box. Uh, call unit 12 on call box. Uh, delivery, door pin, delivery. Here we go. Call. All right, I'm gonna just let Eric know that I've arrived on the app and calling him on this box. Eric don't seem to be answering. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. I called him on the box. No answer. I texted him. It started an eight minute timer. Okay. And I'm just waiting now. Okay. Well, you did all you can do. Yep. I'm just going. I'm going to earn this funky little $3. Come on, bro. All right, look, so an eight minute timer has been started. Six minutes to go. Come on, man, I'm gonna I'm call him one more time. See what happens. All right, so this is the second time I'm calling this guy. I texted him. I'm gonna text him one more time. Hey, Eric. Uh, four minutes and 47 seconds to go. Did this guy fall asleep? I'm gonna give him a call on the app. I've texted him. Okay. Went through the directory twice, so I'm gonna just call him on the app. Man, let's do it at the same time. Call has been forwarded to voicemail. If this guy doesn't answer in three minutes and 36 seconds, dinner's on me tonight. Door unlocked. Oh. Okay, go ahead, go ahead. Eric? Yes. 
All right. Oh, you're making me nervous, man. I was like, this guy is not answering. I appreciate it, Eric. You have a nice night, man. Well, that was fun, you guys. I got a delivery under my belt. I'm gonna go right here. I saw a bike lane. But yeah, it was fun. I had uh, my wife out here with me. I don't have to lock my bike up, and I had no choice. I didn't have no bike lock uh, chain or U-lock or foldy lock. I didn't have none of that stuff today. Uh, we initially came out just so that we can get some shots on the slider which we did but i appreciate everybody who's been patient with my channel it's been a long time since i've been out on this bike man uh my shoulder was hurt really bad it was broken in the uh, i got it was broken in on the back of my shoulder somehow i had a, a like a hairline whoa i thought it was you i was like oh gosh please no my wife scared me that was scary Come on, make this light. All right, I'm gonna get to Archer. But I appreciate everybody who's been patient with my channel, you guys. Uh, it's been a long time coming, man. It's been like eight months since I've been out here on this bike. When I got hit by that car, it, it, bent, it bent the frame on my bike to the point where nobody wanted to actually try to fix it. Um, and the, everyone basically told me uh, to go, you know, basically i have to buy a new bike because nobody wanted to touch it and it is pretty like you can totally tell that the frame is bent um i tried my best to like bend it back um and i was six i was able to successfully bend it back a little bit but i'll cut to like uh a video showing you like just how badly it is i'm out here with these guys right now but look let me show you guys what i was talking about so look at the clearance here between the tire and the frame. I can't put my fingers in there. Oh, my finger won't fit compared to the other side where there's just, you know, my whole hand pretty much goes in here. Um, the guy that I took it to, he was a super cool dude, man. Uh, but he didn't want to touch it, man. He didn't want to be responsible if he couldn't fix it. I don't know. It was just a bunch of stuff. but. He pretty much wrote a letter letting uh, the uh, letting my lawyer know, like, hey, man, like, this is pretty beat up. Like, he shouldn't even be riding it. And I, I technically should not be riding this bike, but I got nothing else. I can't talk much about what's going on with the case because I honestly don't know what's going on with the case. Um, I'll let you guys in on whatever happens when it happens, but... Right now, I am riding a bike that uh, kind of is, is a little scary to ride. It's a little sketch, but that's all. It's all I got. the The most important part is that my shoulder feels way better, um, and my knee feels way better. My shoulder was actually the the worst part. It, it took the like the worst hit when the car uh, actually rammed into me. Um, I broke it. It was like a hairline fracture in, on the back of the shoulder and then a, a, bu a bunch of muscle tears on the front of the shoulder. It took a long time, man. It hurt a lot for a long time. And then I, I, I kind of kept hurting it, man. Like one time I dropped my phone and my immediate reaction was to reach for my phone with my right hand. And man, it brought me to my knees. I was just like on the ground ready to cry because it hurt that bad and then one time I took my shirt off this was like when it when like maybe like a month into hurting it I took my shirt off too fast and bro I was on my knees again man I was just on my knees like because it, it my shoulder was just hurting so it's like I, I kept re-injuring it from time to time but I'm all better man uh, don't get me wrong my shoulder still right now to this day is still hurting like i'll wake up and sometimes it's just really sore and that's just what i got to deal with right now um but i've been working out i finally was able to get back into the gym and doing the things that i do at the gym um not me the the the, the bad thing about all of this man is that I gained a lot of weight, man. I am like 227 pounds, dude. When I got hit by the car, I was doing really well. I was on like this, this streak of working out and eating well and 
and I was like at 203. I was about to break that 200 pound mark, man. So, man, um, getting hurt, I just sat around, man. I just had a very sedentary lifestyle. I wasn't really doing much. Um, I couldn't do much, man. Even walking, walking was hard, man, because you got to swing your arm a certain way. And, and so, yeah, man, I, I tried my best to stay active, but ultimately I didn't, man. And, and I just gained a bunch of weight, man. So I'm, I'm real heavy right now. This bike is feeling all 227 pounds of me. Battery's dying a lot faster, but I'm, uh, now that, now that I'm back out here though, man, I'm going to start, uh, you know, getting, I'm going to be getting a lot of cardio. I'm going to be getting a lot of cardio. So hopefully that helps me get back down um however i am happy to be out here this is what i love to do i got my wife behind me she's back there doing uh doing her best to support me and uh i can't wait to to, to get this channel going you guys i'm gonna uh try my best to stay healthy not get into any more uh accidents and um, thank you all for for supporting me, man. I appreciate all the comments, man. All, all the nice, all the nice words that everybody was saying to me. Um, really outweighed all the negative comments that I was getting, man. Because I was getting some some negative comments, and you know how it is, man. You could get you can get a hundred nice comments, and that one negative comment, man, will bring you down. Like that's that that sucks. But I didn't let it. You know, I I, I persevered. I kept it moving. I said, forget it, man. You know what? Nobody, nobody knows me like that, man. This is this is my struggle. This is my life. I'm gonna do what I gotta do to succeed. And that's what I'm gonna do, man. I'm gonna just keep it moving. I'm gonna keep it going. And I appreciate everybody who left a nice comment and who supports me and 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 and, and was there for me, letting me know that they can't wait till I come back. Guess what, baby? I'm back. Let's go. <sighs> well, whoa, dang, I just, dang, my Ninja Turtle trash can just got beat up, dang, that sucks, okay, I gotta get okay? everything, my Ninja Turtle thing got beat up, oh no, yeah, by the the by the tripod. Awkward ass tripod. I hate that tripod, man. You know that thing was seven, eight hundred dollars. Hey, all right. Let's go ahead and start uploading everything. <laughs>